Hey, what is up? This is going to be an interesting little find. Got this uh, York unit here where somebody put a universal fan motor. I mean, you could definitely tell when the idiots leave the reversing wires hanging out the top. And the run capacitor is down there. Yeah, run cap banded. So, uh, see, I'm going to try to put this in the same spot when I get in four rows in. I got about 130 degrees. There it is, about 131 degrees, and keeps going up and down between four and 500 feet per minute. It's not CFM, it's just reading air velocity. It's probably, as this thing shakes, it's probably jumping, but I could kind of see that it's hovering around 500. Now it's even going up a little higher, 600, so. I'm gonna put this uh, OEM fan motor in there see the because this seems to be blowing awfully slow I mean it looks slow even for an 850 rpm motor what do they got in there it is an 825 so I wonder if they changed the it doesn't seem to be blowing that much air so that's a universal 825 let's see what the original is see if it's the same rpm it is it is 850 RPMs. I mean, 25 RPMs ain't that much difference, but I don't know, man. That thing's like, you can almost see the fan blades. It's moving so slow. I mean, the camera effect's making it even worse, but I mean, it's moving pretty slow. You know, when we have another unit with an OEM motor in it, moving more air than this thing. So I'm gonna check this out. See that? The run cap bandit. Idiots that don't know how to wire a motor back as three wire, so they think they need to use all four wires. See, four wires, both browns, going to the capacitor here. They don't know to cut off the brown wire at the white stripe and just run the fat other brown wire all the way back, home run where the capacitor goes. So they got to hang this shit hanging down underneath the fan, like Rigment, like most of the techs at the service center do and other places like that. <laughs> just crap. They're getting paid by the job, paid by the hour, and that's the kind of crap they'll do. And it's horrible. Okay, got the OEM motor installed. No wires hanging through the top. Wires all home run back to the control panel with the uh, OEM dual run capacitor. Use two capacitors, because that's what you got, that's okay. No capacitor hanging down over there. That's the way it should be. Okay, with the new OEM motor running. Wow, well, it's actually a little, it should be a little bit warmer out, but 116 degrees. I might still be climbing a little bit, and about 2,000 feet per minute. In case you can't hear that over the fan, that was creeping over 116 degrees at about 2,000 feet per minute of air with the sensor laying in the same spot, the same fan blade, with an OEM motor instead of that universal. So I was up with that universal motor. Um, this is an 850 RPM OEM motor, and the universal is 825. Um, I'll put it up on screen. You divide that by 60 to see how many revolutions per second. You're gonna see that's like nothing as far as difference. They're basically not gonna get much difference in performance between those two. So, uh, but something was up with that. Like I said, that fan blade was, uh, you, I could almost see it spinning. It was so, so slow. And uh, this one's definitely moving more air. As you can see, it like it was moving double the amount of air, or at least more feet per minute. You'd have to do the calculation to get the cubic feet per minute. But anyway, job well done. OEM motor, perfection.